universe just exploded. The following is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from Brooklyn, New York, weighing in at 215 pounds, the captain, Steve Rogers. If you listen to After the Bell this week, you know this is a match I've wanted to see for quite some time, and it's almost time to start. A competitor who always has his game face on, ready for a major battle. And here he comes. And his opponent from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 218 pounds, the Assassin Psycho Wade Wilson. I spoke with his superstar earlier. They predicted not only a win, but also, quote, a masterpiece in the ring. Well, the WWE Universe seems to agree with that prediction. Well, I, for one, can't think of an even more egotistical thing for any superstar to say. Are they aware that the match hasn't even started yet? The competition level has never been higher, but this guy's ready to prove he can hang. It's extreme rules, folks, and the action can leave you speechless. Corey, how does a competitor adjust to this brutality? Well, the main thing is to remember that anything you can imagine is within the rules. All is fair in love and war, and that goes for extreme rules, too. What would you know about love, Byron? But anyway, the pin or submission has to be in the ring to win. He thought he had it. Power slam. Goes into the pin. He's able to kick out before two. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't. Probably not going to win for a couple hundred years, Byron. You know why? Because the Billy Goat's curse is in him. The Billy Goat's curse is broken. Caught with a lariat. Byron, a match like this is when we see how merciless someone can be. Thinking about a submission here, Case. Uh, Boston Crab. Trying to free himself, trips the ankle, and he's out. And kicks off his opponent. Uh-oh. Shot in the back. Rolling cutter. Is it enough? He kicks out instantly. Not yet. Down on the windpipe. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Blocked the effort and cut them off with a shot to the gut. Oh, what a roundhouse. 
He's looking for something. This could get dangerous. And it's time to play the game, as they say, with this sledgehammer. Way to steer clear. Oh, my God. Slam, making it look easy. Oh, split leg drop. Great flexibility. Ouch. He's looking a little off balance. Belly to back. It couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that. Oh, driving the elbow. Punch lands. Looking to lock it in here. Campbell clutch. Someone's getting, you can feel him desperately trying to find a way and he does. Boom. He switches it back around. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? Looking for something, anything under the ring. And now with the kendo stick in hand, he's ready to do some real damage. Down on the ground, getting pummeled by that hammer. Every successive move is putting their opponent in a dicey situation. Great counter. And gets tossed back into the mat. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Oh. Kicks out after one. That's smart. Taking the one to catch your breath. Oh, that's just an agitating thing to do. Oh, vicious knees and kicks back here. My goodness. Oh, just defenseless as the momentum is against him. Yeah, the defects in his game are leaving him vulnerable. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. And the hits to the core keep coming. Taking this outside. This could be good. Into the ring again. Oh, he has to be at his limit now. Not what you want to see by any means. Whack. This is turning into Swanson Street. He was elusive there. And one more reversal. Talk about evenly matched here. Wicked kick to the face. He's getting a huge boost right now from all those chants and cheers. Such an underhanded tactic there. And he's soundly taking control here. This is what he feeds off of. And that was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. He has him right where he wants him. Both knees into the face. Now that is the kind of move that wins matches. Two, and he's still in the game. I'm pretty sure everyone in the building thought that was going to be the end of it, myself included. When your opponent can hang after all that, you're wondering if earning a win might just be impossible. And what a maneuver we just saw there. These men have been all gas and no brakes tonight, and they have to be feeling the effects. Well, they have to be running on fumes. I don't know how much longer they can go. Big forearm. Oh, what a clubbing blow. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. That's a free fall. Outside the ring now. He has no need to rush. Settling on the kendo stick. No good can come from this. Spin kick to the midsection. Well delivered suplex. And he's ready to throw out all decorum in this one. Oh, looking to end it here. This could be it. No 
Oh, he gets the shoulder up. I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Ooh. And he's able to counter. And the wear and tear keeps mounting on him. Not the place for him to be right now. He has to turn this around. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Needed the gut creates separation. Able to avoid any harm there. From behind. Back suplex. And he gets set back into the ring. No clue what he hopes to find down there. Oh, great. Now for something painful and tall. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Nice snap, Mare. Ooh, a chop. Boom. This fight is going down right in front of our faces. More up close and personal than I'd like to be. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. He's setting it up on the ring apron right now. You've got to wonder what he has in mind here. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. End of days! Okay, he's re-entering the ring. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Everyone get out of the way. These two are abandoning all restraints. And what need is there to go looking under the apron like this? He grabbed the chair. Uh, now would be a good time to run. Oh, tossed hard into the ring post. Looking vulnerable on that top turnbuckle. Uh-oh. Oh, and what a right. Now ascending to the middle rope. This is going to be bad. Angle slam. So glad I bet on him to win. Shoulders down. What a kick out. I don't believe it. I can't believe that th this whole arena is in shock. Yeah, but no one's more shocked than the man who thought he had a pinfall. And there needs to be a refocus now. That was the moment that could have been. Rolling thunder into the face breaker. Will that be it? The Will cover. that be enough? It's over. Brutality finally comes to an end. Here is your winner. The Assassin Psycho Wade Wilson. Putting the locker room on notice with a win like that. I can't even imagine enduring everything we just saw. This is what it really takes to be a WWE superstar.